Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Dragon's Dogma 2, where this beam of light is beckoning us. Unfortunately, it is also beckoning us while Kiko is near death. Silverius is just over half, and Ulrich is right at about that 50% mark, and we don't know what is about to come out of that little portal. We are, just to get you caught up, we are just southwest of Vernworth. The capital of Vermund. Apparently, we are at the Vernworth Southern Ruins. And we're going to go interact with this, use our God's Bane, and see what's going to happen. Quite the arena, though. So I imagine it's going to be something big. There's also a little bit of elevation. So I'm guessing it's something I'm going to be needing to climb on. Right. I know, I know. Let's begin with the place most likely to be marked for destruction. Why can't it be a little like... Oh. What in the world? I was going to say, why can't it just be a little toy dragon again? But no, no, no. We've got this dragon... Bur oh, look at the things on the neck. Okay. Oh, right. Peril posed by the dragon far exceeds that of other monsters. I it would imagine. Oh, it just... It just doesn't stop. It just doesn't stop. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Uh, he's also got... Oh, don't go in the brine. Don't go in the brine. He does also have some marks on his legs. Which I just landed on. Perfect. See if we can't. I wonder if this will stun him when I knock those down. He's taking really good damage there. Oh, but so am I. Uh, I think it's time for a savagery extract. Maybe even a stoutness for this. Come on, get up there. I'm on his leg. Oh, am I high enough though? No, I need to go higher. Don't knock me down. I think I have actually... Oh, gosh. You need to land, friend. Oh, I didn't actually break. I only broke, I think, one. Thank you for the buff there, Kiko. I might try to go on top of him. Just because I don't want to be on the ground when he's doing that. Oh, there's someone is back too. That's perfect. Go. Start clearing these away. Looks like I'm hitting mold. Oh, who's down? Kiko. Yep, of course. There goes all of my stamina. I'm going to have to use a mighty Roverant just to get some stamina back. Oh, Kiko. Who's getting Kiko up? I have no idea. But it's it's an amazing ability, whoever it is. Okay, get up, up, up. I'm gonna focus on the tail. It's not much, but it's something. Thank you for the buff. Okay, I'm not doing anything else. I think I already broke it. Uh, you know what, let's get off and get some stamina back. Uh, what are we doing? Watch it. Oh, big slam. Okay, on the leg again. Huge damage coming in. Just keep focusing. Is he, he's down, he's down, he's down. Oh no, that's protected. Okay, I need to get on the other side of him. Well, I think we have to break this one on the back. Which we might have just done. Uh, Alright, I think his back by his wings is now unprotected. Okay, hey, get up, and then let go. Oh, I thought I could stand. Feast your eyes on this. 
Oh, Kiko, that was amazing. That was really well done. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. I see that, but all of you should probably get away from that. Everyone up here, up here, up here. Let's wait this out. Our foe is blessed of swiftness. Yet the terrain is in our favor. With plentiful footholds for which to strike. Kiko's the only one who can strike right now. Oh, are these things gonna stop? Or it are we at least protected up here? Uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Okay, I think we're good, we're good, we're good. Go, 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 go. Don't be kicking. Don't be kicking. Got me. Darn. Ulrich and Sorvarius are up there, though. Oh, that was perfect. Right on his back. Wait. I don't... Oh, I'm underneath. I'm not on his back. I thought I was. That was Ulrich. My stamina is completely nil. There we go. We're good. Watch the... Big swipe. I got actually the perfect guard on that. Not a clue where I am. Get up on those haunches. Okay, mighty Robrent to get some stamina going. And someone's down. Oh, we got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. Jump down. Jump down. Oh, it's Silverius, too. Alright, I'm gonna go for it. Just don't even, don't even look. I, am grateful to you. I don't know... Oh my gosh, he's got two health bars left. Ulrich, take him down. Go, go, go. Oh my word. Ulrich, yes. Where, where else is he vulnerable? The horn. Okay, that's all right. Oh, it's not okay. Ouch. Watch it, everyone. We can get this. I just got to wait for him to... Oh! That was perfect. There we go. Big damage. Gunning skewer. Uh-oh. Hold the skip. Is it not over? Okay. Red Cloud's advance is halted. This reprieve may be a temporary one, but I'm glad for it all the same. Oh boy. So, that is three out of the four portals closed, yeah? Okay, that's good. Well, I think it's time that we head to Vernworth and actually convince them to leave in that case. We also just got another 90 Worms Life Crystals, which is fantastic. We've arrived well enough. Where to next? Uh, well, I don't, I don't know. Because do we want to, I would imagine, I mean, the leaders of the land technically would be the Queen Regent, but I don't want to go talk to the Queen Regent. Do we need to talk to Brant? Traveling merchant. All right, Dudley, what do you got for us? 
Whole lot of nothing. Thank you, though. Hope to see you again. So it's not evening. Oh, doesn't matter. How glad I am to see you safe. Where have you been this past month? The end of the world. Are things truly so dire? They're not great. Though, I am aware of the dragon attack on Melf. We received word that naught but a smoking ruin remains. It was a tragedy, and I would not see it repeated. However, without a clear path, we and the guard shall be hard pressed to forestall the impending crisis. You would have me evacuate the city. I see. Mayhap it would be for the best. Ever since the fall of Mel, the citizens of Vernworth have lived in fear that their homes are next to be assailed. If there is safe harbor to be found elsewhere, I believe we have naught to lose by seeking sanctuary. But I doubt I could convince the people of this city to abandon their homes, however terrified they may be. Methinks your majesty would do better to ask this of the Regent King. Oh my goodness, Sven. After the false sovereign vanished and the world was altered, his grace has been the one keeping order here in Vermont. If the people will heed anyone, tis him. It is admirable how Regent Kin Sven has taken up command of the kingdom. We would be remiss not to offer him our aid. That is true, and hey, Sven likes us. Let's go see what Sven needs. I mean, I gave him an ornate box, right? Also, I bought the box for him and gave it to him freely. But if you just give him the money, you have to give him a thousand gold and he never repays it in full. We shall wait here till your business is done. Also, whatever happened to the queen? Did I just completely botch a quest or miss a quest? I mean, she never really got her... her just dues. Alright, is he just hanging out up in his room? Can I just go sit on the throne, by the way? Also, is Alina still in jail? <laughs> I haven't gone back to check on her in some time. So you've come. I'm glad to see you. He looks older, doesn't he? Captain Brandt has already apprised me of your proposal. A full-scale evacuation of the citizenry. H how did he do that exactly? Truth be told, I had reached the same conclusion. Great, then go. So long as we cow within these walls, we must live in fear of going the way of Mel. My ministers have approved the plans, and I have petitioned the encampment survivors and the Thieves' Guild for aid. The only remaining obstacle is my mother. She has set herself stubbornly against any such flight. Oh, don't worry about that, because I don't care. I have tried to make her see reason, but of late she has taken to shutting herself in her chambers. However, I fear that my position permits me to entertain her fancy no longer. I must put the needs of the common folk before her selfish whims. Now, there are a few matters I must attend to before we can evacuate. And I would fain welcome your assistance. We will require several ox carts to carry the sick and aged out of the city. Makes sense. Might I prevail upon you to petition the merchant at the ox cart station in the west of the city for their use? You may assure him that the Royal Treasury will foot any and all expenses. I mean... I should probably go talk to the Queen, huh? Looks like that's an optional objective. Let's go see if she'll talk to us. Queen Regent Deesa hardly leaves her chambers, and all her meals come back scarcely touched. Between you and me, I fear for her health. Yeah, let me, let me go in and talk to her. Have you come to claim my life, Arisen? Well, far be it from me to deny you. Alright. 
liking the way that this is starting. But I shall go to the grave with a smile on my lips, for I have no regrets. All I did, I did for my darling son. Yeah, this this just reeks of Walter White's justification in Breaking Bad. You know, did it for his family, did it for his family. And then finally, spoiler alert, in the final season, he admits he did it for himself. He did it because he liked it and he was good at it. And that's exactly what Deesa is trying to claim. So do as you will. I have no intention of begging for mercy. I'm not going to kill you. I mean, I've caused a lot, a lot. It's the ornate box. I've caused a lot of problems for the people here in the world, but uh, never intentionally. I wish I could actually see if there's something hidden inside it. The throne and its powers hold no meaning in a broken world. Right. The throne. Or seeing if I had anything I could give her. No, there's nothing I could do. What if I go talk to Sven? With the ornate box in my possession, will will that do anything to try and you know convince him to go talk to his mother one more time? I don't know. Yes. I can give him the ornate box. Okay. This was in Mother's room. I did wonder where it had gotten off to. But why would she? Check the. Check the compartment. Hmm. There's aught inside. It is a letter. I... Might you excuse me? I would speak with Mother. Mayhap there is hope of changing her mind yet. All she did, all the scheming, all the plots, it was all for me, you see. All right, I'm going to go along with it. I don't agree with it. So I... I cannot leave her to her fate. Ah. Uh, all right, Sven. In the meantime, while you're doing that, I'm going to give you some time alone with dear old Mumsy. And I... will go handle the ox cart situation. Plus, don't worry about me and the money. I, I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right for myself. Oh, what what is the lesson to be learned through all of this, huh? I just I keep thinking back to Isaac. Isaac wanted the best for his daughter and for his wife, but really for his daughter, especially because his daughter mentioned something about having having more. And that really resonated with Isaac so much so that he started to read these grimoires that were damaging his eyesight and ultimately led to his his wife and child turning to sand in front of him. And then we have Queen Diza, who, uh, I mean, the number of atrocious acts that she had to commit in order for us as the Arisen to be sold into slavery, to establish a fake Arisen, to champion with Lord Phasus, to create a magical device so powerful that the pawns would bend it to their very will, all of that just to give her son a, a better chance? There has to be... Okay, as a father. As a father... My first response is, yes, I would do absolutely anything to make sure that 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 my son is happy, healthy, well taken care of, and, and set up for success in life. But this goes beyond that. This isn't just survival. This is stepping on all of those around you, paying no mind, no attention, no, no heed whatsoever to the wants and needs and survivability of others just so your your child has a better chance and that mm, I can understand but I can't empathize cards are mine I paid good gold for them and if you think I'll surrender a single one you'd best think again I require the use of all of them to transport my wealth to safety oh that's not gonna happen Alard. 
Begging your pardon, sir, but I've just sold off my last cart. That fellow over there gave me a handsome price for half a dozen of them. Yeah, uh-uh. Be gone with you, ruffian. And if you think I'll surrender us, I require the use of all of... Hmm. These writings could be of import. I really doubt they are. Take a peek. Apologies, but I can't offer... Tis my duty to hear the people's concerns. What if I just get in? What if I just get in and sit, huh? Alright, how are we going to solve this? Kiko? I like your style. At last! Is this enough to have avoided the worst? So what, what can we do? I can't give you anything. I require the use of all... Begging your pardon, sir. What if I just... What if I just made Alar disappear? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Carts are unavailable for hire till further notice. Yeah. I've heard some interesting tidings about town. Regarding the Vermundian military, yes? It would seem the Queen Regent has made significant alterations to the chain of command. Oh there. Faring all right? Yeah, I'm doing okay. But I need to make something happen here. And I don't know what. Can't. There's no option to give anything to either of you, right? No. I don't think murder's the solution. But murder's the only thing coming to mind. Maybe I should go back and talk to Sven? Let's see if the quest has any information on it. Assist Regent Ken Sven in seeing the citizens of Vernworth to safety? No. Yeah, it seems it seems optional. Uh I don't mm. Fine. What are you doing? Put that away. I wondered if maybe this might get him talking. No, spare me. I pray you. I fear for my life. Hey. Well, <laughs> reckon he won't be coming back here in a hurry. <sighs> That actually worked really well. As a matter of fact, I'd like to thank you for that. It didn't sit right, see? Having my wares claimed by some puffed up minister trying to save his own skin. Anyhow, as long as I've got my gold, who takes the carts is no concern of mine. And if that craven comes crawling back, I'll tell him bandits took them. You're a good man, Russell. They say a crisis reveals one's true character. But that man was no less miserably selfish than he always seemed. Fantastic. All right. And back up to Sven and see how he's getting on, getting on with his mom. Materials, eh? I shan't deny they have their uses. I'm really enjoying the post game. It's it's kind of ugly. I miss I miss the greenery. It's not our place to hurry the arisen. The world was was wonderfully vibrant and green and lush and and again lived in is the phrase I keep using, and now it's just desolate and rather, uh, you know, kind of one shade of weird, ominous red. But in terms of the evacuation, I really, really love how this is working. It's a very typical RPG quest trope where, you know, you have multiple large objectives 
large quests in multiple cities and you have to achieve many smaller objectives to make them happen but they've all had unique solutions and i i like it mother i must beg your forgiveness oh sven i believe that you desire to make me sovereign solely for your own benefit she did but in truth you sought to better the lot of our people ah but i would have benefited and handsomely at that besides i cannot deny that i was proud i wish to see my own son on the throne and no other even so i cannot help but feel that all of this could have been avoided had i only been more attentive oh the ch this is breaking my heart the son is is blaming himself for the the parental misgivings oh i don't like this if i had but better known your heart i could have shared in your burdens you would not have had to suffer alone and perhaps together we could have walked a better path oh sven mother i beg you join the evacuation you need not fall with this city i would not see you take your crimes wholly on your own shoulders that weight is as much mine to bear as tis yours my son you truly would make a fine and goodly ruler your kindness will save many lives of that i have no doubt So, is she coming, or...? Ah, you've returned. How fares your procurement of those carts? Oh, we're good. You do? My thanks. That puts paid to the last of our preparations. I will inform the citizenry forthwith. More crystals. More gold? My thanks. You're welcome. Oh, boy. There is potentially not, not much left. We gotta head to the volcanic island camp. Don't, don't just jump. Ugh. I've been avoiding resting. I have been avoiding resting because it does seem like time is of the essence. But I don't think I can hold off any longer. Our party has seen better. You know... Actually, I have a horrible, horrible idea. You see, if I were to get Silverius incapacitated, let's say, and if I were to go back to the Riftstone, he would come back at full health, and I could rehire other pawns at full health. Oh. That sounds terrible. No, do it the right way. Just sleep. Just sleep. We'll we'll go to the volcanic island camp and we'll sleep. But first, but first, we have 125 worms life crystals. Now, I could use that to get another weapon for a subsequent playthrough, say a duo spear or a trickster sensor. I'm kidding. I will never ever do that. But I could also go and get some new There's armor. After you, arisen. Let's hold off. We're, we're doing all right. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to use this. We're going to go to the volcanic island camp. Hopefully the inn is still standing and I can rest there. And then we're going to make our way west what about the checkpoint rest town i understand there's there's no big calamity nearby but yeah it, it seems like there's still other people that might need to be assisted oh we also have a maxed out fighter you're no soldier are you i'd not recommend camping You'll await me the blank so let's do vocation guild seekers i don't have any we got another augment diligence hastened recovery when down to crawling amazing absolutely we're gonna grab that and we are gonna equip it augment strength uh polarity and hue let's do 
Let's do that one. And what else do we have? No. Okay, there are new weapon skills. There's... Okay, actually, I don't think these are new. Perfect defense is really good. I might actually put that on instead of hindsight sweep. But do I need two? I don't think I really actually need two. I'll buy them. Yeah, and there's a 3000 Divine Defense. Consumes less stamina, which is really good, but I don't have the ability. I actually like the skills that I have. Always a pleasure. Lo, a ballista. <sighs> All right. You know, so I'd not recommend camping. As much as I'm, I'm honestly nervous to do this. Let's go ahead and rest. Hopefully, this doesn't come back to bite us. Eleven hundred rift crystals. Thank you, everyone. Whoa! What did we get? Salubrious draft, a fairy stone, Matea. Seriously, two. What is? Layla gave me an eternal wake stone. When invoked, it restores any fallen in the vicinity of the holder to life. Hold. Where does one get that? Infernal edge. I already have one of those. Cyclopean thunder. Look at that. Not incredibly powerful, mind you, Layla, but still a very, very welcome weapon. Also, Layla, too kind. Too, too kind. Put it all in storage. Thank you so much, Layla. Our adventure continues. Very, very excited about the Ready to forge on? those weapons. Okay, yeah. Oh, there it is. So... Down here, are you going to tell me about the evacuation? Ah, I remember you. What brings you to the encampment? You need to leave. It is a miracle you're still alive. Though I dare say that's true of all of us. Oh? You believe we ought to evacuate? Well, you traveled far indeed to deliver these tidings. Farther, I dare say, than anyone would go for the sake of an idle jest. Hmm. If we must leave, we shall have to begin preparations at once. But I think we're a bit short on hands to attend to all that must be done. In fact, there's a rather delicate matter that I could use some help with. A blacksmith and his wife dwell on the encampment outskirts. Might you escort them here so that they can join the evacuation? You know, it's funny. I was actually just thinking Goutstifer is not part of any of these. It would be a real shame if he wasn't aware of it. Smith, Gustavo is a man of good sense, but as for his wife, well, suffice to say, Cleuna has always been a contentious sort. She's been fine. She'd have naught to do with us, given the choice, and isn't likely to take kindly to the arrival of any of my knights on her doorstep. Really, she just doesn't like the looks that she gets when she's presented with her dwarven husband, given that she's an elf, but if you just treat her with respect... I can only hope that she will be more willing to listen to you, a third party, as to her. And while you're taking care of that, I will see to it that the incumbent is made ready to depart with all due haste. Okay. Ah, I remember the blacksmith and his lady wife well. I only hope we can convince them to join the evacuation. Uh, yes, I do agree. However, I'm only just realizing I should probably go speak to the... There is an apothecary oh, shop, right? Chest. Or is the armor the same as the apothecary here? I've weapons to truth be told. I'm of half a month. Do you have anything? Okay, you do sell panacea, mighty roberance. Oh, you do sell some roberance. I am not against these. I mean, I have the money. I'll take it all. I'll take it all. What a, oh, a couple of fairy stones. <laughs> I'll take them. I will take them all as well. Going to pack up and leave. Much obliged. I'm still thinking though. I mean, I've been focusing Ought on these towns. Time. On... Ought we once held to be true is now changed. Hmm. 
would affect such a change? And for what purpose? What's my weight situation like? Average, okay. These don't weigh very much. These weigh a little bit. Let's see if we can't get down to light. Three wake stones. Ugh. I don't know. Should I have brought more? Three should be fine, right? So I think what we'll do is we're going to head to this weird portal cyclone thing. There's a griffin. In the distance, though. Let's go take care of whatever nightmare fuel this is. And then we'll make our way up to, to Gautstaffer. Gautstaffer, however you want to pronounce it. This should be the final one. I don't know what that'll mean, but we'll see. Same thing? Really? That's disappointing. It looks to be the exact same thing. Alright, savage uh, savagery extract. Um Get up there. Huge damage. Huge damage. Just keep breaking them. Okay, those are broken. And now his back's already exposed. Where am I? Okay. I'm off. I'm off. That's alright. Watch the big swipe. Watch the slam. Climb. Come on, Ulrich. Come on, Silverius. Up. Let's go. Huge damage. I mean, just crazy damage. You need to fall down, sir. He's down, he's down, he's down. Just hop off to regain your stamina. Okay. Where else does he have them? Is there, are they on his neck? Oh, they are on his neck, okay. But you're all doing just an, a remarkable job. Nice dagger. I'm joining ya. I'm joining ya. I think. Thought I was. No. <laughs> Alright. Do a little heal. Don't love what he's doing. Don't love what he's doing. What is he doing? Oh, 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 I don't think I want to be on his tail. I think we should run. Everyone, back up, back up, back up, back up. Just run away from him. Look there. Are those inflamed portions? Right. It's the source of its power. Inflamed portions? You're talking about on his person, all right? Like on his body? That's okay. Just keep running. Stay away, stay away. Oh my. I can't see. Oh! Heal up. There we go. He's down. 
no idea where I am. Oh, but we're right there, right there. Go. Attack. I think this is his final one. And we might have just broken it. I can't tell. Yes, we did. Okay. Got him. Oh, much easier fight than the last one. Still a little bit disappointing that out of the four portals, two of them were the same. Okay. So because we stopped all the portals, does that buy us more time to do evacuations? Will someone not explain what is happening? Can I be honest? I want to go kill that griffin. Because we got some really cool armor from the chimera. Maybe we can do the same here. Also, wow, that thing. That thing noticed us from far away. Hold on there, friend. Oh, let me get up. I want to get up to his wings. Where's Julie climbing? All right, never mind. Just attack. Go for the haunches. Knock it down. There we go. Huge damage. Look at that. Oh, yes. It's not getting up from. Oh, it is getting up from this. No. Okay, time to get off, 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 off. I'm trying to get off, but I'm just doing follow-up attacks. I'm trying, but, oh, stamina. Well, there we go, we got it. <laughs> I'm okay, I'm all right. In fact, I'm really good. Fairy stone, nah, no unique armor. All right. So, time to head to Goutstafur. And Goutstafur is... There. All right. The Wind Windwalker's home? Is that his name? I guess that's maybe her name. All right. Let's set a waypoint. Let's do let's do number five. And what is... What are you attacking? There's another griffin there. But how... No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. Can we get up here? You all can do what you need, but I'm going to start making my way. What road am I on? Not the right road. Just turn around. Oh, we're going down to the cave, though. I would like some friends with me. That sounds like a minotaur. Or it's just going to be silent. Never mind. Am I the first to notice we've all got different vocations? Yep. That is most fortunate. In our several months of in-game travel, you are the first person to point that out. Well, well done. No one can defend themselves when battles like this. Oh, 
Okay. Good kills. Let's go. I have a few scrapes and grazes, but nothing of consequence. When calm, be sure to avoid open flame. Yeah, game game definitely needs a hard mode. Feel like I'm e I'm not even playing perfectly. I'm far from it, but it feels it feels like I'm incredibly overpowered for what we're doing. Also, I guess I could have just run down through because there's no more water to deal with, huh? Ah, stupid rattlers. I shall let them harm you. Oh, jeez. Got you. I'll let you handle the next one. All right, what do we got? We got some skellies, but actually, we don't want to be this low to get to their house. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. We could pick some now and use them when the need arises. Yeah, I don't care about Sorian. Just walk past him. Or run past him. Doesn't matter to me. Just run. We'll have to deal with it when we when we escort him back anyway. Unless wait. I understand the pawns come with me when I fairy stone. Do they as well? Thank you for the gentle touch there, Silverius. Well now, whatever brings you here? These are perilous times to be wandering about. You'd have us evacuate with the encampment? I am touched by your kindness, friend, but we'll manage on our own. I couldn't bear to be pressed in among those crowds. Uh-oh. Now, now, I'll hear none of that. I'll see you to safety, my dear. Come hell or I, Walter. Hey, guys. Besides, we got some business to attend to. Soul has earned your trust by now. Help me out of a tight spot on more than one occasion, if you recall. It seems like maybe we're impervious during conversation, though. <laughs> After all that goodwill and the long trek out here to warn us, we seem like the unbreakable, turning our back on another helping hand extended only in kindness. Oh, very well, my love, if you insist. It seems we'll be accepting your offer after all, friend. Would you be so kind as to escort us to our destination? That's why we're here. Let us see our charges to the Ahem. So anyway, <laughs> are you ready? Oh, jeez. Huzzah! What a team we make originally. Let's go. Let's go. Would you care to behold a forgotten rift stone? No. Undiscovered in this world? No, the time for the rift stones has passed, friend. But I wouldn't mind taking a shortcut if one exists. Like for example, could we just cut straight there? Well, go take a look. Oh, there's that's a Big rift in the middle. Of the oh, we could go down here, though. Hmm. We'll have some skellies to deal with, but maybe this is a shortcut. Yeah, we know. Is this the way we want to head? Yeah, we'll just follow this. This should get us close. Oh. 
Okay, the jumping heavy attack is pretty awesome. And victory shall be ours. Okay, take care of the smaller ones. Okay, don't make them explode, though. That's when it gets gross. I see a chest up there. Probably a fairy stone, but I want it. Is there more? Oh, yep, we got the shocking kind. Okay, good. Everyone good here? Oh, Rift Crystals, okay. Seems late in the game to be getting those. Is there a new red cloud? Whoa. Got lots coming. What is happening? <laughs> Love the pandemonium. Is that it? We're doing okay? Let's move. No solace in victory. We were overconfident in our abilities. It is a painful reminder that fortune will not always favor us. Is this really going to be the last evacuation? Why is this one so tough? Goodness gracious. Okay, where's this heading now? It's gonna go north, but really what we need to do is find a way out. Is there a way out? Yes, there is. Perfect. All right, I'd say that was rather straightforward. We even have our friends in tow. Huh. You can count on me to fly from Rose. You're you're wonderful. I appreciate you, but no, no thank you right now. Yeah, the only the only other major town whoa I don't know because there's the checkpoint rest town there's also the nameless village that's the thieves although that's the thieves guild and Sven already mentioned the thieves guild so I would imagine they've already got them notified yeah nope I, I lost my friend oh they're here well here we are how long before the evacuation begins, I wonder? Would you find Serenesto and tell him we've arrived? Let him know that we'll wait here till the time comes. You got it. Oh, oh a ballista. It kind of feels like I'm, you know. Sir, I implore you to reconsider. Surely you can see that the situation is dire. How many times must I say it? I'll not be ordered about. Not by ye, not by anyone. Do you need more new liquor? Now bugger off and leave me alone. Ah. 
Ah, good. You're back. I'm afraid there's another matter for which I must beg your assistance. It concerns the fellow I was just speaking with. Sir Lamond, his name is. The man's something of a regular at our hot springs. We've met. I sought him out to tell him of the evacuation, but he has flatly refused to join us. I must confess, I'm at a loss as to how I might convince him. Could I prevail upon you to try your hand? At this point, he thinks anything I say will fall on deaf ears. Yeah, we'll we'll give it a go after hundred soldiers. It would be reassuring to have his aid. Shall we speak with him? Yeah, we shall. Tis as you say. But only after we come here. You're no soldier. I'd not recommend. And we're going to withdraw. Let's see. First off, uh, can do we have any more fruit wine? We don't have any more fruit wine. I used all my sorting tails anyway. But I thought we had at least one more newt liquor. We have three more. Just in case we need to, uh, you know, Always give him a little bit of liquid courage. Tis a ladder. Shall we see where it leads? My guess up. Or down, depending on what side you're on. Hey, stop right there. Fancy meeting you here, cuz. Did you want something? <laughs> not this again. I'm here to live my life as I see fit. I'll not be ordered about by anyone. Not even you. Request guard for Smith and wife. Have him escort Batali knights. Let him do as he pleases. What if we let him do as he pleases? Now you're cotton it on. No need to worry about me, cuz. If trouble comes calling, I'll be sure to scarf her. Glad we understand each other. I can take care of myself. Sir uh, has refused to lend his aid. And it seems there's little hope of changing. Whoops. I thought maybe that would ah. Oh. No, 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 no. Where is he? I did not expect. Yeah, I just I just goofed again. Where is he? Well met, sir. Greetings. I it's healing water what? to draw upon the vault. Do come again. What are you doing here? Stop trying to get people in the bath. I thought if I let him do as he pleases, he'd respect the fact that I wasn't going to be pushy and then join us. And it backfired. A treasure chest. Oh, my mistake. Tis merely another spot for gathering materials. Oh, where's he gone? Uh, all right. Let's tell Ernesto. So, Sir Lamond is not to be convinced. It would have eased my mind to have him join us, but I suppose there's not to be done. The hour of our departure is almost upon us. It will be slow going, no doubt. We have wounded whom we must accommodate. Yet, come what may, I swear to see them all to safe harbor. Well, shoot. Disappointed in Lamond. Now he is the importance of aiding Ernesto. Isn't isn't there a book, The Importance of of Being Earnest? Okay, so we've evacuated. But there's more. Okay, so the quest didn't complete, meaning there is more. Alright. Tell you what, with the time we have left, which is seconds, <laughs> I'm gonna go to the checkpoint rest town. That's the last big civilization I can think of that might need some evacuation. And if so, I don't even know who to talk to about it. I think it looks like we both got some time on our hands. Hmm. Shops closed. 
perhaps the people up at the gates? The guards? I mean, I could talk to Mirden, yeah. Where's everyone? I mean, there's people here, but not, not too many. I mean, it could just be that they're part of either Vermund or Batal, depending, and... Oh shoot, he's gone too. Maybe I should just head back to the Mad Sovereign and see... I mean, there's only a handful of people left. All right, let's run up here really quickly. And just see if there's any guards or anything posted. If not, this might already be evacuated. I think they're gone. Oh, the gates are... Gate's already up. There's no one here. Oh no. Okay, we might be nearing the end. Interesting. Did they add port crystals for the end game? Because all of these are the ones I placed. All of these are the ones that are already there. Do they do they try to make it easier on you? There are now people here. Since times of remember. Okay. We're not going to do that. We are going to. We could buy two new weapons. But let's focus on the armor. There's the Stygian Omen, which is amazing. We're going to buy that. And then I can get either Executioner's Greaves or the Meddlesome Queases. And I think those look cooler. And that would only be a hundred crystals. I should probably buy the Unmaking Arrow. And do we want to buy Dragon's Rancor or Dragon's Vein? Probably Dragon's Vein, right? Or the Dragon's Aegis. Really just get fully decked out here. Close to the veins of lesser drink. Then I bid ye farewell. Okay. So enjoy stocking up on supplies. We're looking pretty good. Go round. I knew it to be so. I'm not sure if this is the end, but it's certainly starting to feel that way. But we'll have to see what happens very, very soon. That's going to do it for this episode of Blue Plays Dragon's Dogma 2. Tune in possibly one final time as we make preparations to hopefully save this world from impending doom, or at least a part of it. Possibly in, in reparations for all the um, harm that I accidentally caused through our journey. But that's going to do it. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you're still enjoying. And I will see you. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'll see you next time.